The Southwest Conference, the good, the dirty, the greed. When people reminisce about college athletics, only a few conferences cause them to think, what a powerhouse, the Southwest Conference was one such conference. Running from deep in the heart of Texas to Arkansas, by the 1970s, its members included the University of Texas, Texas A&M, Rice, TCU, Baylor, Texas Tech, SMU, and the University of Houston. A premier football conference, it had legendary coaches, legendary players, and won many national championships. But it fell apart when the desire to win overshadowed ethics, and teams began using almost any means necessary to succeed. The conference had the worst kept secret around college football for recruitment violations. Boosters paid student athletes on the table to attend their alma maters and for the performance on the field. In the 1980s, seven of the nine schools served some type of probation. In many cases, school personnel and even Texas Governor Bill Clements were not only aware but involved. Constant NCAA sanctions led in part to the breakup of the Southwest Conference. In 1986, SMU received the harshest punishment called the death penalty, which terminated its entire 1987 and 1988 football seasons. The University of Arkansas left the Southeastern Conference in 1991, and in 1996, the Southwest Conference members disbanded. Texas, Texas A&M, Baylor, and Texas Tech went to the newly formed Big 12. TCU, Rice, and SMU went to the Western Athletic Conference and the University of Houston became a charter member of Conference USA. Since then, these conferences have realigned multiple times, leaving one to wonder if the long-standing powerhouse conferences are a thing of the past.